It's one of you, beautiful. Okay. I'm Curly. The kids are excited. <laughs> it's Thomas the Train and Friends Day. We are heading to Chattanooga. We're meeting my mother-in-law, Sandy, and her boyfriend, Steve, there to see the train museum. It looks like I got pulled over for speeding. Well, this is embarrassing. I wasn't speeding. I was doing like... 83 he said so get your heart pumping in the morning <laughs> let us off on a warning so this here let's get out of jail free card right there upward and onward we're gonna have a family day surprisingly enough we beat them there i'm practicing looking into the camera okay give me a brag and sandy comes over yeah. to check pulled in to over. see if it was us they that got pulled over gone, um, speeding past us <laughs> was it us <laughs> it was us with the family ready to go, everybody heads inside. I told Jackie to introduce where we were, and she said, Thomas! I used that porter potty and it was regrettable. We could pick a tattoo, so we made a selection. He hid his tattoo in shame. I got a tattoo. This kid just looked dangerous. The hoodie, the tattoo on the arm. This guy brought his dog. Sir, you can't have your dog here. Take it outside. This guy looks like a cowboy, and our son looks like he's Swedish. Look at this foreign kid. He looks like the Grinch before he goes down to Whoville. He looks like Tweedledee. What's going on with this sock situation in sandals? Whose idea was that? And here's the Thomas the Train balloon, and there's Thomas the Train. This guy is more popular than I am. This train is a freaking celebrity. Look at this. He even got Jackie wearing the hat. This looked like a scene from War of the Worlds. Oh, somebody's gonna get left behind. We finally got on the train. It looks like they decorated for my quinceanera. Nathan enjoying the view. We went over some water. This guy came along with junior engineer certificates, and Steve got one. I think Sandy said something like, oh, Steve. And finally, we arrived at our destination. There was food, a petting zoo, and even a cornhole. And I scored three points. And we've got the restaurant right next to the petting zoo. Restaurant, petting zoo. <laughs> restaurant, kind of strange. They had ducks, chickens, goats. These goats were really hungry, man. They were aggressive. It was like we were feeding them crack. I don't know what they fed these goats, but they were wigging out. I wonder what the weight limit is on the train bounds. No scissors, no watch, no shoes, no first aid. The safety rules include no first aid. Oh, I guess I can't go on. I brought scissors. I tried to get in with my scissors. I even tried to bribe her and she still said no. Nathan is having a party. This little girl is obviously drunk. Nathan pushes someone over there and then falls over himself. Everyone got out, but Nathan didn't want to get out. Nathan is refusing to get out. They try to coax him out. Jackie's got to go in. What did Grandma say? Nathan, let's go get a drink. <laughs> Taking that lemonade like it's a cocktail. Finally, Jackie wrangled him and brought him out. He wasn't that happy. I think Jackie just wanted to get in there anyway. Look at her. She looks upset that she's not allowed in. The face of jealousy. Jackie, it's children only. I guess Jackie didn't read the sign. Children five and under, not 35 and under. And there was this creeper. Sir Topham hats here. Everybody looked busy. We went to the balloon guy who beat up this little Asian kid with a ninja. Another Asian kid ran up. I wonder what he's making. Oh, look, another ninja for the Asian kid. And a squid, because that's all they ate. This guy's super racist. He swore up and down this had never <laughs> happened to him before. Sweet flip move. Let's see that again. Finally, I get to the front. We're making a red T-Rex. And he goes to make me what he calls a T-Rex and gives me this turd. Look at this he gave me. This thing looks like an overcooked hot dog. What do you think of that, huh? <laughs> That's right, even my two-year-old has the sense to see this thing is trash and wants to pop it. And that was the end of the Thomas the Train excursion. We came as a family and we left as a family. Finally, we got out of there. Tattoo still on hand. This is not true. See this? 200 pounds. <laughs> I'm like 210. Maybe 230. I tried to make an outro, but couldn't think of anything to outro on, so I chugged some coffee and started acting weird. My neighbor Nick called me because he needed help moving a refrigerator. We just moved the fridge. It was me and Nick. Lindsay ran for it, but I still Lindsay, caught her. Gotcha. <laughs> Nick is a lumberjack. Hey guys, I love you. Thanks wood. for watching. Make sure you subscribe. Does that. Nick does that.
I'll see you tomorrow. I could feel my fillings move. I should see a dentist. Subscribe.